I closed down the million dollar agency that I've been running for the last five years, and then I started a new one from scratch. And with it, I've closed $145,000 worth of clients in the last two months alone on the side while spending most of my time working on my main business. Now, you probably can't see this, so we'll have to throw a screenshot up on the screen for you to see, but this is $30,000 worth of client payments in the last week alone. Essentially, I disassembled the core of the dying SMA business model, then re-engineered it, and it transformed everything. Quite simply, the amount of demand I've been experiencing as of late has shocked me. So, if I had to start all over from scratch today, what would I do? Well, this. I call it IPGA, Info Product Growth Agency. As it stands, nobody's doing this, but everybody needs it. Now, you and I both saw the golden era of dropshipping back in 2016 and the golden era of SMAs in 2018 to 2020. Since that, a bunch of decent business models have come and gone, but now we're entering the next golden era of online business and education. With that said, for those of you who are new here, let's rewind and get some context. I've made millions in online business and with my agency by now. And when you're up, it's a different game. But my story starts five years ago in boarding school when I first started my social media marketing agency. As some of you may know, I rose to success pretty quickly. I signed my first client with my agency on a $5,400 deal three weeks after starting it. And that was possible back in the golden days of the SMA game. I then went on to grow my agency tremendously and have done multi six figures with it, sometimes per month over the last couple of years. And that's great. But SMA and all the other current online business models out there just aren't what they once were. It's not as easy, you can't make the same amount of money, and it's just a different game. I've seen thousands of agencies come and go. Most of them barely make any cash flow. And for those who do, the work simply feels like a regular job. There's little to no actual entrepreneurship involved in it because it lacks creativity and deep impact. You're no longer getting clients because the service you're offering your clients just isn't causing that big of a transformation. It's not life changing. So. What's the solution here? Look, as you may have suspected, it's the people that are creating the courses that are making the most money in the online business space, not their students. They're all teaching different online business models, but in fact, most of the money they make comes from selling the education itself to you. And so how can you, as a beginner, get a piece of the pie in online education? Well, that's what I've been trying to figure out. I've been away from social media, I stopped running my agency, and I stopped scaling my own online education. I've been putting my head down to develop a bulletproof future plan for my own online business and for everybody else in the space. I've been taking a step back to analyze and really figure out what is the next big opportunity for people like you and I. As soon as I got the idea, I started testing it out. And as I said, in the last two months alone, I've closed $145,000 worth of clients while doing this on the side. It's not even been my main focus. Now, I suppose this begs the question, how does this thing actually work? What we've done is we've combined the agency model with online education. And when you think of it, it just makes so much sense. There are millions of professionals out there that want to start their own online education, but they have no idea where to start. They need help. They need your help. The truth is that scaling to 30, 50 or 100 plus thousand a month with an online course is surprisingly easy. But as a beginner, you can't create an online course business because it takes experience, skills and results to actually make it profitable. But what you can do is you can learn the process of creating, launching and scaling online courses and then you can make bank on helping other professionals do it. It's really a win win. Your clients get to impact thousands of students with their knowledge. They get to make millions in the process of doing that all while you're getting a chunk of the pie. Imagine that you've helped five clients, five professionals to create and scale their own online courses up to 100K a month each. And these clients are paying you a $2,000 base retainer each. So that's $10,000 total plus 15% of their course revenue. Five clients doing 100K a month each, that's 500,000. Now you're getting 15% of each of their revenue. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that's $75,000 a month plus the 10K in base retainers. Now, if that's just aiming too high, if that's just too much money for you, then imagine just doing this with one client. 2K base retainer plus 15% of their 100K a month revenue, that's $17,000 a month with one client. If things don't go perfectly and your client just makes a third of that, well, one client is still worth over $5,000 per month. All right, that's sweet. Maybe this is something you want to do. As I said, if I was to start from scratch, I know this is what I do. So what would that process look like? What would it look like to start an IPGA from scratch? What are we doing for these clients to be able to charge them that much? Quite simple. We help them build the foundation of their course. So that's the curriculum and the overall vision. Then we guide them on how to actually produce the course. So material production and recording the lessons. 
Once that's done, we'll help them with all the backend when it comes to launching and administrating their course. So how do they host their course? How do they host their community? How do they build a sales funnel, etc. And finally, when we've produced the course, launched the course, and it's up and running, well, it's time to scale that course. And that's where the real money comes. Because when we help these clients scale up these online course businesses with paid ads and organic marketing, they quickly start making 50, 100, 250K a month. And once again, remember, if you're taking 10 to 15% of that per client, you're making pretty good money. I already showed you 30K of client payments in a single screenshot a little bit earlier in the video. One of my clients that I helped launch and scale a course did $25,000 their first month, $250,000 last month, and is now well on their way to doing 500K plus a month. Imagine taking 15% of that every single month plus the original base retainer. Now this leads me back to you because there's one big problem here and it's the fact that you don't have an IPGA yet, okay? A couple months back, I didn't either. And so the main question of this video is, how would I start an IPGA from scratch today? I start by learning the base service first, so understanding and getting an overview of the overall course industry and how to create and launch courses. Then I build my agency foundation, so getting my IPGA website up and actually creating business cards. Now I'm not talking about those new digital business cards on your phone. I'm talking about real, old fashioned, physical business cards. And then of course, I start signing clients. I wouldn't even worry about learning how to scale courses before I had signed my first client and produced their course, because only after that comes the actual scaling process. Different courses in different industries need different types of marketing. And so I'd pick and choose what marketing and scaling services to learn depending on the needs of my clients as I moved on. But how do we actually get clients for our IPGA? Well, the beauty first and foremost is that this service pretty much sells itself. Most people, when starting their online businesses, they get it wrong. They keep searching for better and more advanced outreach methods, when in fact, the main problem is just that their service sucks. Nobody wants their service. And so that's why they keep having to level up their outreach game in order to sign clients. But when you have a service that everybody wants and needs, you don't need advanced outreach methods because you can just go into this street, yell about your service, and people are gonna be interested. The fact is, my hairdresser wants to be my client. My lawyer wants to be my client. My international tax consultant wants to be my client. Even my tennis teacher wants to be my client. These people are all interested in turning their expertise into online courses and making more money with it. The other day I was having a conversation with an interior designer. What did they ask me? If I could help them start an online course business. Every professional out there is considering doing this. They just need help to actually make it a reality. And if I never left my house and I didn't know anyone, I'd probably just go on LinkedIn, connect with a couple hundred professionals and DM them all or PM them all if they wanted help starting an online course. Then of course, when you're doing 50K a month with your IPGA and you start to scale up, well, we can talk about more advanced client acquisition methods. But for now, as I said, this service just sells itself. So what's next? Well, personally, I've been working on my new business, Coed. So that's Center for Online Education and Transition. We'll be doing IPGA ourselves and we'll also be teaching how to do IPGA for people like you. Why, you may ask? Well, because I can't single-handedly serve all the millions of professionals out there that want to create online courses. We need a whole army of IPGAs to meet the demand out there. Now, with Coed, not only are we going to be doing IPGA ourselves and teaching IPGA, we're also going to provide the platform needed for both course creators and IPGAs. What do I mean by that? Well, coed.ai, the new platform that my team and I have been working on, will have every single tool that an online education business will ever need. We're talking course and community hosting, sales funnels and websites, AI-powered marketing sequences and communication channels, calendars, sales calls, anything an online education business will ever need, we got it in Coed AI. In other words, it has everything you and I need to manage our IPGA clients. Now, our mission here is to make Coed the most well-respected and impactful institution in all of online education. We're kind of taking the by the people, for the people, with the people approach. We're not doing like masterclass.com and just pairing up with famous individuals to create expert courses hosted on a monopolized platform. We're not teaching you about a bunch of different online business models. What we are doing is acknowledging the fact that online education is the future. And so we want to help more professionals create online education. And we want you to be a part of that. As said, not only are we going to be teaching and helping professionals create their own online courses, we're going to let you help them as well. So you can get a piece of the online education pie and be a part of this incredible revolution when it comes to education. You're going to be making lots of money with IPGA while making the world a better place in the process through more education. Now, to round this video off, I know it's not the usual thing to do. Most people in my position right now would just slap a call to action in your face. But for now, all I wanted to do was just come back and share some insights on what we've been working on and to tell you about this new golden era opportunity that we're entering. Finally, my mission on here 
here moving forward is to be the most transparent, in the trenches, down to earth, online business guru in the space. Not gonna hold back, just gonna give you everything because it actually serves both of us. We're on the same side of the spectrum, we're doing the same thing, serving the same types of clients and working for the same cause, and we're all gonna get rich in the process. That's what I find quite beautiful about this mission that we're on. So with that said, I'll see you in the next video.